Hallöchen liebe Freunde und da sind wir wieder heute wieder mit L.A. Noir und ich würde sagen wir setzen gleich mal ähm, die Geschichte fort. Wir waren beim gefallenen Idol stehen geblieben. Bukowski, you have a new case. Two women, possible drink drive. How was that a case? Broad says she was dope, and that somebody tried to kill her. Where did this take place? That's the bitch you're gonna love. Right across the street. What? The Chevy style line took a nosedive off the escarpment, fetched up underneath a Cola King billboard. Up to it, boys. We got bad guys to catch. See you later, fellas. Try not to work too hard. Ja, versucht nicht zu hart zu arbeiten, ja. Gut gesagt. I'm just trying to fit in. Educated, hardworking, straight as an arrow. Hey, to break it to you, Cole, but you'll never fit in at Central. You got a stakeout down on second later tonight. Ähm. Ich glaube, von hier kommen wir nicht ran. Ich glaube, da müssen wir doch das Auto nehmen. So, mal gucken, wo wir da hochkommen. Äh, ich glaube hier nicht. Oh, I knew I should have driven. Hier sieht's gar nicht mal so schlecht aus. Ja, das sieht doch hier gut aus. Stop just ahead. Face looks familiar. Well, that's June Ballard, <laughs> Tarzan's sister, beast of the Amazon. She's married to Guy McAfee. The captain has moved to Vegas now, but the two of them still have juice. Phelps, traffic. Detective Phelps. Hey, Bukowski. Long time no see. You could have called this in by megaphone, Enrique. <laughs> Phelps, this is Enrique Gonzalez. Enrique was a pretty decent middleweight. What do we have, Gonzalez? Broad drives right through the empty lot and off the side of the escarpment. Her story is that a movie producer doped her and her friend and sent the car over the cliff. Was anyone hurt? Driver's beat up. Not too bad considering. If she hadn't hit that billboard, we'd be scraping both of them off the pavement. Passengers are Jessica Hamilton. She's just a kid. She's pretty knocked around. Kid gonna be all right? I think so. They've taken her to Central Receiving. If you want to take a look around, you can stall the ambulance. Thanks. Do that. One more thing. Watch out for the driver. She cuts rough. Okay. This ain't the red carpet, so get out of my way. Ah, so where must we then? Erstmal hin. If you're looking for the coroner, he's down by the crash site. Da ist der Krankenwagen. Okay. Mrs. McAfee, we would like to ask you a few questions, if that's okay. I prefer to use my maiden name, June Ballard. You might be familiar with some of my work. Can you tell us what happened here? You're kind of cute for a cop. Die geht ja ganz schön ran. What about me, June? I'm a big fan of Beast of I don't like. Keep out of this. Okay, angeblicher Drogeneinfluss. We understand that you're still suffering from the effects of the accident, Mrs. McAfee. The officer says that you claimed that you were drugged. Who did this to you? That rat slipped us a Mickey Finn. No wonder I feel so dopey. I can't remember. Hmm. 
Na, ja, da zweifeln wir mal an. It's a serious offense to withhold information from the police during a criminal investigation, madam. I told you to call me June. <laughs> You're making me feel like an old lady. And don't bother your handsome head about this. My husband will settle the score with Mark Bishop. Okay, Mark Bishop. You mentioned also. a Mark Bishop. You think he might have had something to do with this? He is a movie producer. As for his involvement, you just leave it to me and my husband to worry about. Uh, ich glaube, die sagt die Wahrheit, ja. It's not going yeah, to play that way, Mr. Klar. We'll take it from there. Das war klar. <laughs> Relax, Detective. You're not nearly as cute when you're mad. Hmm. Ja, warum haben wir es auch nicht angezweifelt? Hm? This is a big scene, Phelps. We need to get our bearings. Let's go see the coroner. Oh, okay. Ich glaube, da müssen wir hier lang, ne? Jo, das scheint der Weg nach unten zu sein. Okay. You want to see this Phelps? There, laid out on the trunk. And that isn't even the best part. Okay. Auf dem Kofferraum, ja. Worn off. Where did you find them? They were stuffed in the young lady's handbag. I'll run a trace for semen when I get back to the lab. Noch irgendwas? Nee. Scheint nichts zu sein. Ach, wieder so viel zu lesen. Okay. Die ist 15. Und der letzte Part hier noch. Ja, die Mütter haben immer so eine Vorahnung, ne? Gut, mehr war ja hier nicht. Hm. Ja, damit kann ich auch nichts anfangen. Funny how that thing at the rail yard turned out, don't you think? Okay, da hat sich wohl jemand den Kopf angeschlagen. Like they weren't more badly injured. Must have been unconscious. Being relaxed tends to lessen the soft tissue damage. Ah, oh, da ist 
doch nichts hier. Hm. Drunk driver? Maybe not. How so? Well, a head I found without a body piqued my interest. See what you think. <laughs> Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him, Horatio. <clears throat> Is it real? No. I think it's supposed to be a replica of an Indian head. Ja. It's some kind of curio or movie prop. See the casting marks? What's it made from? Plaster of Paris would be my first guess, then painted. So we can rule out the murder angle? No, you can rule that in. That thing was wedging the accelerator to the floor. Whoever did it wanted these women dead. Okay. Find anything interesting? We should speak to Ballard again. She might not be telling us the whole story. Ja, werden wir gleich machen. Bloß noch mal hier kurz reinschauen, ob wir hier noch was vergessen haben, aber nö. Sieht nicht danach aus. Alles klar. Dann werden wir noch mal mit der Banner drehen. Ich bin bald fertig hier, Detektiv. Und ich habe andere Fälle, die ich mit dir mache. Natürlich ganz verschwitzt an durch das ganze Laufen. <lacht> so, falls zwei Fahrerinnen. Was kannst du uns über den Fahrer in deinem Fahrer erzählen? Jessica Hamilton. Poor Jessica. Es war ein schwerer Tag für sie. Sie ist desperate, um Filme in die Filme zu bringen. Was mehr kann ich sagen? Äh, nein, an Zweifeln. How old is Jessica, Mrs. Ballard? Das gibt's doch nicht. Say how old Jessica is. Das war jetzt alles verkehrt old machen. Enough, sweetheart, as the saying goes. We found a shrunken head. It was used to tamper with your car. You see, I normally don't drive off cliffs. The last thing I remember is getting behind the wheel. Uh, nein. It's obviously some kind of movie prop. You must know where it came from. In case you hadn't noticed, I am the talent. And the talent doesn't deal with props or sets or any of that kind of stuff. <laughs> Why don't you ask Mark Bishop which prop house he uses? Mrs. McCaffrey, I think it would be in everyone's best interest if you accompanied Patrolman Gonzalez back to the receiving hospital. I'm going to be okay. These guys can take me home after my lawyer and I have talked to the news hounds. Mrs. McAfee, you are still under the influence of narcotics. You're likely to go into shock once the drugs wear off. And I thought you were a heel. It's nice of you to be concerned. Es geht doch immer here. nur ums Business. Let's see what we can shake out of the kid. Ah, alles klar. Uh, fahren wir mal zur Zentralklinik. Officer, please, tell me what's going on. I don't think you're a fool, but what's my opinion against thousands of others? Zach, send it back to you. Don't miss me on him. The car crash victim has regained consciousness at Central Receiving Hospital. 11K Roger, en route. Oops. Christ alive! Nicht lang. Äh, sagt mal, wo müssen wir denn hier hin? Hier sind wir doch richtig. Okay. 
also wirklich direkt äh, neben, unserem, äh, neben unserem Hauptquartier. 